Hi, everybody. I'm Britton, and we are a family of five, so I'm one of the five faces uh, that you'll be seeing and meeting throughout different videos. I was piecing together a video about what I use as my wipe solution. as I was doing that I didn't include and I don't have a video about where I get my white pieces from and what I did was um, upcycled a flat sheet and it was a flannel flat sheet we don't use flat sheets so I upcycled that into the cut size pieces that I chose and that'll be included right after this and these are some different sizes too these are almost like a pretty close maybe a little bit bigger than toilet paper square. This is like a large napkin, little crooked. I let my kids help me, so they don't have to be perfect. It can be fun and involve the family. Um, they do fray. I do sew, but I didn't sew these. I didn't see why. Um, I can deal with the fraying and trimming them off during after the wash and dry uh, we've cycle. We've been using cloth for over a year on and off there are definitely times where i get overwhelmed and i just kind of take the easy way out and do disposables but we've been doing it on and off for over a year maybe almost two or something and i do love it and the more that i upcycle and find different things to make myself i've actually had better experience i like i use them for napkins or non-paper towels um dry toilet paper and I make wet wipes for baby and us in the bathroom too. Um, I also didn't include in this little clip of how I wash or store them when they're dirty. There's a couple different options and I plan on making different videos for like my uh, laundry soap that I use but you can if you like liquid you can basically at the end of the day use this solution as well. <clears throat> Um, you can store them in a wet bag in the bathroom until you throw them in the wash. Some people wash them separately than their clothes. Some people throw them in with their clothes, whatever you prefer. Or you can use some kind of bucket, a five gallon bucket with a lid, um, your, a small trash can, and put some vinegar and water in it and let them soak until it's wash time, depending on how often you wash them too. So it all depends on what you need to do and we'll be making different videos for all the different things that we upcycle and use to be more self-sufficient because when life throws you a quarantine uh, Because when life throws you a quarantine Because when life throws you a quarantine and there's no toilet paper we are not stressed out about it so hopefully this will make your guys's quarantine a little bit easier it's not gross or anything um, if you have any type of experience with cloth diapering it's no different than that so enjoy like subscribe so that you can follow us along our journey and hopefully we can help you along yours as well